there! Today I'm going to go over our Touch Behold setting products, our powder and our spray. I'm going to start off with a clean, moisturized, and primed face. I'm going to start off with my BB cream. You can use whatever foundation you want. These products work with them all. Once I'm done with my BB cream, I'm going to brighten up that bottom eye area, my under eyes, with a little bit of concealer in a V formation so that I am brightening up a bigger area than just my under eyes. And then I'm gonna soften up the edges with my liquid foundation brush. Once I'm done with that, I'm gonna go in with my setting powder. This is going to lock my foundation in place and remove any oils or any of the moisture that's in my makeup that would give my face a sheen. So I'm using a fluffy brush. You wanna make sure that you have powder on your brush, but you wanna tap off the excess, but you still wanna see it. And then you're just gonna tap it into your face. You wanna press it into your makeup because that's gonna ensure that your makeup is not gonna move. So I'm just gonna press it all over my face You can see here the difference. I have a slight sheen on one side and the other side I do not. It's kind of like walking around with an Instagram filter. You can also use your liquid foundation brush for this. I like to use it for my under eyes because it really gets all the setting powder in where I need it to be. If your concealer creases, you're really gonna wanna do that. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with my bronzer. I'm gonna start at the top of my hairline and go about mid cheek. And then I'm going to brush it back into my hairline. This is creating a contour, but it's a subtle contour. And then I'm going to go under my chin. Contour those double chins away. And then I'm going to go up on my forehead into my hairline. That's also going to contour my face. This is going to warm up our face after we have our foundation coverage. So you can see I've already got more of a defined cheekbone just from that. Now I'm gonna go in with my blush. Our blushes are super pigmented, so you're gonna wanna make sure to tap off the excess and go really light on your cheeks. Don't go below your nose or it's gonna drag your face down, but go really light and then go in an upward motion. It's gonna drive all the focus up and it's gonna give you the illusion of a lifted face. So less is more. Our products are really pigmented. <laughs> Once you're all done with your makeup, this is when the setting spray comes into play. So it's like hairspray for your face. It's gonna lock your makeup into place. You're gonna wanna go in an X formation. And if you have makeup breakage or extra oil, go in a T as well. And this is gonna dry. It's gonna have an amazing, beautiful finish. And there you go, your makeup's not gonna move. 